So today I'm gonna to show you how you can make a table inside of Canvas. And you can use a table to do hyperlinks, you can use a table for a lot of things. So the first thing you're gonna do is go to your page, and I made a new page, and I just called it Sample Table for now. So I have a new page, I'm gonna to go to Table, you're gonna make however many rows and columns you need. I'm just gonna pretend like we're doing enough for a week. Okay, and now you have your table. But what I'm gonna also show you is how you can edit these cells, you can merge them, whatever you need to do. So you highlight the cells you want to merge, like put them all together. Let's go to cells and go to merge cells. So now this can be your title. So we'll just title it weekly schedule. Okay. The next thing I'm going to try to do is to change the background of the cells in your table. So if you want it to match your um, color scheme or whatever pattern you've got going on. So you're going to go to cell, cell properties, go to advanced, and then you're going to put your background color. So here is where it gets tricky. You can either type in the color. For example, you can type in black. And there it is. It's black. Now I'm going to change my font so you can see the font color. Change it to white so you can see it. Okay. So you can do it that way. Or you can go back to your cell, cell properties, advanced. And you can go to a handy website that allows you to pick the color like this. Um, this is... I'll link this website down below, but this is my favorite one. It's HTML Color Picker. So it gives you whatever color you want. And down here you see the shades too. You type, you copy and paste this number. This is your HTML code. You're going to put it in here where your color would be. Press OK. And then now it's that specific color. So this is one way you can really make your tables specific to your needs and your colors by doing it like that. So yeah, let me know if you have any questions down below.